Thank you so much. It's, uh, it's overwhelming to be here with these uh, fantastic people. It's a thrill. Um, a lot of the credit for, for this award uh, goes to my editor, John Morgan, who's here. Uh, yeah. Uh, and, and Jillian Goodman at Business Week, who handled the Miami story. Uh, they're here with my wife. Yeah, she's great. They're, uh, <laughs> they're here with my wife, Laura, and my parents who came down from Toronto. Thank you for being here as well. Uh, let me just take, take a, a second and explain why this uh, is so important to me. Two years ago, I pitched John on a new kind of climate beat. And, and the idea was we would look at the effects of climate change on every part of American life, uh, and then try and look at what the response is, what it should be, what it is, what it will be, uh, what parts of the economy will have to change, how will they change, how are they changing now, what will it cost, who pays for it, who benefits, who loses, sort of the classic journalism questions, but applied to this quickly evolving problem. Uh, and then we got into the hard questions, which were, so far, who deserves protection the most? Which industries, which cities, which towns, which groups of people, which lifestyles, which things that we care about the most? And if there's not enough to save all of that, how do we choose? And to my astonishment, John uh, said yes. He went with it. Thank you, John. Uh, and we're still, even two years later, just at the beginning of that coverage, finding out what the right questions are. And the reason is that that governments are still just beginning to understand what this means, and businesses, and insurance companies, and banks, and developers, and home buyers, and city planners, and people still don't know what this means for them yet. Uh, but I think the one thing that seems certain to me is that as important as the journalism is that looks at why this is happening and what we do to the planet, I think even more captivating and I think more vital will be what the planet does to us and to our institutions and what it reveals about how we, how we value each other. Uh, and, and I can tell you to a certainty that officials around the country are already grappling with that, but they're not always doing it with a lot of knowledge. Uh, and so, you know, it's such a thrill to be recognized for this because there needs to be more journalism on that. We need to help inform officials and voters because otherwise they'll get it wrong. Uh, so thank you to Bloomberg News for letting me pursue this coverage, uh, and thank you to the foundation of the award. It means, it means so much. Thank you.